I am honored to be here. The soldier, above all the men, is required to practice the greatest act of religious training. The will to win, the fighting heart, are the honored hallmarks of the football coach and player. This nation salutes you, and on behalf of all of them, I thank you. leads the warm up. When you think about a game, a rivalry like this that's been going on for over a hundred years, it's pretty humbling. You don't really recognize the enormity of the moment. You sort of realize the magnitude of it over time. The game has followed me through my life. This is a 52 yarder. Still gives me goosebumps. For me, it's been over 50 years I will always remember the Army-Navy game. Napoleon McCallum, United States Navy, Lieutenant. Mike Mayweather, field artillery officer, United States Army. Blue, blue, it's funny the things that you remember. This another definitive moment in the ball game. It's such an awesome opportunity that you have to serve something bigger than yourself. Makeda. This is the foundation of what it means to be a part of a team when it matters. Thompson is going to go 96 yards for a touchdown. Omari Thompson, West Point class of 2002. The kick is good. We'll be carrying around Frank Shank at Annapolis. We'll talk about memories for a lifetime. Brings back memories. Frank Shank, Naval Academy class of 91. Amar Bradshaw, quarterback, West Point. Kurt Heiss, place kicker. Captain Mark Schickner, United States Marine Corps. For a lot of us, we know that like, hey, this is it. 22 players on the field, regardless of what team they're on, within a very few short months, they're putting their lives on the line. It's called duty, honor, country. Oftentimes, that means laying down your life. These kids that are playing right now, they were born in a world at war, and they still decided to go to West Point and the Naval Academy, and they still play football there. It's, ooh, sorry. <laughs> it's a special kid. Yeah, that, that's emotional. <laughs> French warfare. There's a purity of this great rivalry. I tell you, you sense and feel every play on that field. It's just a different type of football. Still blocking and tackling, throwing and catching, and scoring touchdowns. Nothing's changed. Giving back to this country, giving back to each other, service, that's what it represents. No matter where we are, we find a place to set three hours aside and watch Army beat Navy. Go Navy, beat Army. Go Army, beat Navy! Go Navy, beat Army. Beat Navy, beat Navy, beat Navy. Go Navy, beat Army! Duty, honor, country.